Hey friends, how are we doing today? So I'm coming back with you today because it's a beautiful sunny day and I thought it'd be a great day to make a beautiful sun catcher uh, wind spinner out of some things that we have around the house, some recyclables. So you're gonna wanna check your recyclable box and get some empty water bottles, clear plastic water bottles. You're also gonna wanna get permanent markers like Sharpies, um, some string, a pair of scissors and then head out to the yard and grab a stick because we're gonna hang these from a stick. And then you can either choose to hang this outside from a tree or you can hang it in the window. Um, you can make a beautiful uh, kind of a windsock type thing or if you wanna see an actual wind spinner, it'll be a lot of fun. So let's get started. Grab those Sharpies, grab that plastic bottle and you're just gonna color all over your plastic bottle. Just like this, I colored one in for you already. So I just covered, I covered it all in stripes. You can do stripes uh, horizontally or vertically. These are vertical stripes. You can do them horizontally so they go around, all around the bottle. Um, I'm gonna move my kitty here because she loved this project. Wait till you guys see the end product. She loves it. Um, so after you have a couple of different bottles, you can do one, you can do 12. It depends on how, how big of a wind spinner you wanna make. Um, but you're just gonna take your bottle, you're going to take your scissors. You might need a grown-up's help for this, but we're going to start out by just cutting the bottom off of our uh, off of our our bottle here. So you can just see I'm just cutting around, and I don't think you should throw the bottom of this away because wait till you see this shape. So when you get it all cut out, look at this. It kind of looks like a flower, doesn't it? So don't throw that away. We can make something amazing out of this. You can make a really cute little necklace out of this or a little hairband or something. They're so cute. I kept all the bottoms of my bottles. <laughs> so after that, here's where the fun part comes in, all right? Because now we're going to use our scissors again, and we're going to cut our bottle in a spiral shape, a spiral shape. So you want to be kind of careful. If you mess up, it's not a big deal. I have an idea for you in case you make uh, in case you make a mistake and it and you cut it um cut the piece off. But let me show you what I mean. You're just going to start from the side and you're just going to cut around and just start twisting the bottle and keep cutting and try to keep it about the same width. And as you can see, it starts spiraling and the bottle starts getting longer and longer. And you just keep going till you get yourself up to the mouth of the bottle. So simple, just like that. And so that beautiful color pattern that you made then becomes this long, gorgeous, fun. Whoa, look how beautiful that is. And can you imagine when it's right in the sunlight? So from here, Take a small piece of string, and then you're just gonna tie the string around the neck of the bottle, and then you're gonna tie the other end onto the stick that you found in your yard. And that is going to be the base of your wind spinner. And my kitty is really getting into this again, so I hope she doesn't knock over the <laughs> video. So just like that. And then we'll tie it onto our stick over here. And then I'll show you because I have a few other ones made. Then I'll give you some different tips and pointers of different ways that you can do this, okay? So here we go. I've got several of them already made up. So there you go. Can you imagine in your yard or in your garden? How gorgeous. Look at that. So beautiful. So many of them, I told you. Job, I really like this project. She was super excited. I'm going to put it over here. You're probably going to hear her uh, play with it. But just so you know, so I said it's okay if you made a mistake, right? So if you accidentally cut a piece off, just put a hole punch in there. String, you can uh, put a string through there. You can still use it. No problem. If you don't have any string, the other way that I saw this made is you can just slip that whole thing right onto this stick. Now the big thing with that, probably it won't twirl. If you have string, it's going to twirl a little bit more in this in the uh, wind when you're outside. But look how beautiful and how gorgeous and how easy was that. I mean, a plastic bottle and markers. That's basically all we use there, love bugs. So I cannot wait. 
Um, just so you know, if you ever make any of these projects, post them, post them on our CRPD Facebook page or our Instagram page. Um, let us know on Twitter. Um, let me know in the comments of my YouTube channel. Let us know what, what you've been making at home because we, we miss you. We can't wait till you're back at the rec centers with us, but I'm super, super excited to be able still to reach out to you and help you be creative when you're at home. So friends, remember to be safe, be kind, be respectful, be responsible, kiss your brains, hug your hearts, and we'll see you soon enough. Be creative, love bugs. Bye.